welcome back to the channel everybody uh, where we talk about restoring boats fixing trucks DIY home projects and that's exactly what we're doing today today we're talking about fixing uh, this old fence I got here it's a metal link fence and I'm gonna tell you a little bit about it this is part one today's DIY project is making a straight fence out of a bent a straight wood fence out of a bent metal chain link fence so as you can see what I've been doing is first I screw I drilled in an anchor board and then I've been blocking it up and as you can see the hard, farthest part out oh man it's about eight nine inches away from the fence at the, some of the farthest part just to get it level all right so the first thing I did was block everything out first things first of course like I said anchor a baseboard and then screw out from that again try not to hit any other screws um, that existed and hit hit the screw as you're blocking out just make sure you stagger them I just went cross left to right and then the next board I went right to left all right used a couple little half inch shims etc to get it level and walked all the way down here and you can it's looking pretty straight you can't see it with the boards but I'll get a different angle once I get these other boards in so that was first step get all my blocks in next step I found some boards at the local convenience store and also in the alley so that was nice because wood is very expensive nowadays next thing I'm going to be doing is putting in a vertical support um, and that's gonna just I hope stabilize it a little bit more keep a little pressure off the ground or keep the, the pressure off the fence and a little bit more on the ground by putting it in these verticals so that's what I'm doing now I got one panel that came with the house I also got one on the opposite end and then I'll have to buy brand new ones which uh, essentially I've been taking the dog for a walk and collecting aluminum, aluminum cans floating around North Minneapolis here and gonna exchange that for um, some fence panels so let's put these in and I'll get another look of how straight we're looking here okay so that's done a um, couple things that I've been using I've been just using an impact driver and I've been using t25 heads and I've been finding my cleanest rusty screws it's like a Johnny Cash song and you're gonna want to level keep all these level and uh, that one's pretty dang good sorry it's a little blurry let's see if we can clean it up there we go right there centered in the bubble now another thing I've been doing is once I get in level I pushed I pulled down on that stud so it actually is like digging down into the ground you can see uh, I, the first time I did it, it was over there so it's really pressing down into the dirt I'm not using any kind of treated ground contact board or anything like that I'm um, just not really worried about that at this time um, looking down the edge of the line uh, all of a sudden I, I'm starting to get a straight fence I had a couple twisted boards in there I'm gonna use a couple uh, composite shims and straighten it out even more I want that to be proper all right look at this fence coming along yep so last time we checked in I put in all these verticals here and now I'm tying it all together and as you can see it's just so nice and straight really proud of it there's a little bow at the bottom there I'm gonna have to go over on the neighbor's side of the fence and maybe pull it in a little bit it, it just can't you know the the wood just twists and everything so again thanks for watching this this is how to convert your chain link fence into a wooden fence again block it out put your crossbars put some more supports do some leveling and today actually I used some of these composite shims there and I actually twisted the boards just a little bit to try to straighten them out make them a little bit true and I got a little bit more custom to do here at the end um, one thing I didn't talk about though is having a nice hundred foot or however long foot rope and uh, I have that that goes up and that's my what I'm guiding um, my line with it's super tight it's like a guitar string tight so that's keeping everything really true as you can see there it's looking really nice and straight and uh, we might put some security extra added security on the top so that might be another video Till then, thanks for watching. Well, 
finish up the project. Um, I started adding a couple little b ground boards there uh, just to keep the cats in a little bit more. I got a few more to buy, but fence turned out nice and straight. Couldn't have been more proud of this. Again, this is how to convert your chain link fence into a wood panel fence, DIY style.